What's good, guys? If you're looking for cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure I head over my sponsor. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout for the most cheapest, most fastest, most quickest, reliable source on the internet right now. Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back on another NBA 2K22 My Team video. And guys, today, um, I'm actually on the next-gen end right now. Next-gen end looks a lot better. Wonder if the gameplay is good. But uh, we are here for top snipe filters, guys. In this video, we are going to give you the best snipe filters to make you lots of MT. And I mean lots and lots of MT. We're going to go over the market. And we're just going to tell you the best possible snipe filters in the game. Um, so, yeah. That's pretty much it. Um, I don't know. Um, it's NFL Red Zone Sunday. I'm very excited. I'm now 21 years old. It's crazy. And also, if you guys do need MT, hit me up. If you're buying, if you're selling MT... Hit me up. If you're into sports cars, hit me up. Instagram, Twitter, links down below. Anyways, let's get into this video. Um, sniping. All right. I actually, I have no MT, right? Because I got banned. If you guys did not know, I did get banned on NBA 2K22 my team day one. So I got banned. So if I had MT, this is what I would do. I would snipe the freaking rubies all day. And I don't know why next gen looks so buggy right now. Um, it's just not playing smooth. I don't know why. Next gen is not playing smooth whatsoever. Um, but the rubies went up a ton. So um, they did rise. Like I said yesterday, there was a huge market rise out of nowhere. So these snipe I'm about to show you are the best in the game. They're honestly the only ones in the game. So what you want to do is consistently, and I mean consistently, just keep refreshing like this. That's it. Just do not, when you snipe, do not buy any of these dudes. They're legends. You want to stay away from legends. Unless it's someone relevant like Manu Ginobili. Like, people don't really know these players, so people are not going to want to use these players. Uh, unless you do get for a good profit. Um, so let's say Otis Thor pops up for 4K, then you're going to buy that. That's a free K. But the legends are a lot harder to sell than current day players. And I'm going to give you another snipe filter right now. Um, so Giannis Antetokounmpo Sapphire is going to be one of your key snipes, all right? And why is this? It's because he just won a ring. It's Giannis Antetokounmpo. He's the GOAT. Um, and he's literally 9,500 MT, all right? You can snipe out this car, I bet you, for 5K multiple times. I think you can. Um, I've tried. I haven't played 2K as much because I'm banned. I do want to go my main account. I was grinding my main account pretty heavy. Uh, I had almost 100k on it, and then I got banned. So it was a little upsetting, I'm not going to lie. Uh, I really just don't want to get banned again. But uh, yeah. Uh, anyway, Sapphire Giannis. You have to continuously check all the Sapphires, bro. Curry, Giannis. You know what I'm saying? Curry Sapphire, guys, is up to 20,000 MT. If you get Curry Sapphire for 10k, 11k, you know what I'm saying? You're making a lot of money. So definitely keep your eyes on Curry. Another Sapphire that I would definitely recommend scrolling through. And honestly, low key, it depends what the Sapphire's prices are at. But this filter's low key as hell. Like this MPJ, if you were to pick that for twelve fifty, you could sell that for eighteen fifty. That's some not a lot of MT, but it's not terrible. You know what I'm saying? So definitely like that filter as well. Amethyst filter's okay as long as you're not scooping legends. And honestly, I think there is really only legends on the Amethyst filter, which kind of does suck. And not only that, yo, they rose up. They went up in price a ton. Um, pretty much, man. Dan Issel, City Moncrief. People hate these cars, and I don't, I don't know why. I like City Moncrief. He's not bad. I don't think he can shoot three well. He's not bad. Ronald Blackman's not bad. Dan Issel's not. He's terrible. Um, but some of these cars, people just don't like them because of the name. They're older. Listen, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna disagree. People don't like these cards because they're OGs, bro. They don't respect the OGs in the 2K community. I don't know why. They just don't like older players. And honestly, if I had to choose out of all these players, I would say, um, ooh, Cliff Hagen's 10K. That actually might be a snipe. If I had the MT to do it, if I had the MT to buy him, I would. Let's see. Cliff Hagen for 10K is a pretty good value. So, yeah, that's a really good value. 10k 12k i would honestly scoop this up get it graded hopefully it gems create crazy out grading cards he's actually a really good card that card's really good um i'm actually gonna pick that up once i get mt so we got that sapphire emerald the emerald filter isn't the best but some emeralds do go for like crazy amounts of money not only just sniping emeralds bro it's pretty crazy some some stuff is pretty expensive on the emerald and 
You just gotta know who you're looking for. Another filter I got for you guys. Um, 600 buyout, guys. 600 buyout. It's money. You gotta do it. Um, try it. Just keep refreshing right here. Another really, really good snipe filter that I highly recommend you guys try. And honestly, guys, I'm gonna end this video early. We're gonna make this video early. Pretty much, the, the snipe filters right now are, are literally amethyst ruby sapphire a little bit of emerald not really and then just minimum and maximum buyout there's no market movement um i don't know it's pretty much it and then you can also try diamond contract or diamond shoes diamond shoe colorways and that's about it um but yeah that's it for the video hope you guys did enjoy first top snipe filters of the year if you guys have any snipe filters let me know have a good one peace